Up next is the game that has been dubbed the game of the week. It was the Citizens FC versus the Reds FC. This was a must-win match for both sides as neither team was yet to register a win. Before kickoff, both managers had this to say. Moments from kickoff, we are with the Reds FC. Now they are the team that has that has the richest history in terms of football in this competition. They have the most trophies, they have the most pedigree, but yes, yeah, still something is lacking. Their first match was a bit disappointing. You lost your first match day one. I'm with the coach, I'm sorry, not the coach, the captain of the team. But you had a great performance in that game. You felt a bit unlucky. Do you think you can beat a team that lost their other game? Because uh, the Citizens FC played poorly in their first match. Do you think you'll be favorites for this match? Um, there are really no favorites, but we're going there. Um, once we put our best in, we are going to come out on top. All right, what's the philosophy going to this game? Same old same. We play attacking football. Do you think your boys will do better this time around? Of course, of course. Uh, Right now, they all get up. They, they, they want to show that they are better than what they showed last time. So, of course, yeah, it's going to be an entertaining match. They're playing against the Reds FCs. They are known as a very good team in the past. They have good players, quality defenders. Do you think you guys can come up with a victory this time around? We're a good team, yes, we can, of course. Yeah. And do you think you guys can pull off a victory this time around? Yeah, obviously. Um, we've actually sat down and looked at what we can do to make it better, and uh, we've worked. I think the players are hungry. After the first half, as the Reds FC rushed into a two-goal lead thanks to a penalty kick by Musa and a wonderful goal by a makeup. Half that was totally dominated by the Reds FC. They went into the break with a deserved two-goal lead. But in the second half, after some words of inspiration from the Citizens FC coach, the players turned the game around with a little help from the Reds FC goalkeeper. Ace got a brace before Rookie completed the comeback to give the Citizens FC three vital points and leaving the Reds to wonder how it all went wrong. You guys came from behind, tough game in the first half for you guys, but you came back in the second half 3-2. What are your thoughts right now? Uh, I just want to say that the players are wonderful. Uh, well, it's like we should start training under the rain maybe. <laughs> uh, but anyways, um, we can come back. Yeah, I think um, I contributed to the gameplay and I added what I could add and everybody responded positively, so yeah. You have had to step into goal twice. You've lost twice and again your goalkeeper has cost you the match in two matches. You have Without any win, what is going through your mind right now? Um, I'm, I'm really not happy, but um, hopefully we'll do better in the next match. You said that last time your team was up 2 0. You had, but you were basically on a holiday in the first half. You didn't have anything to do. Second half comes through, and three goals in the space of about 10 minutes. I mean, what happened? Did you switch off defensively? I think uh, I think it was the rain. Let's blame it on the rain. You think you can now challenge for a title? Yeah, I think we can do that. We've always had the quality. We still have the quality, and it was 
belief that we needed and we got that today. So I think going into our next game, we'll have more confidence. And that's it for this week's Social Liga Highlight Show. Until next time, be good and stay blessed.